welcome to Marine Connection. My name is Yanni and today I'll be presenting this brand new Cobia 237 center console to you. We're going to take a little overview on this boat and then take it out on the water show you how she performs. Starting off at the very rear of this particular 237 is made into a Yamaha 250 four stroke outboard. Yamaha outboard is extremely reliable, extremely fuel efficient, uh, some of the best outboards out on the water today and they are extremely quiet. Forward. We have our swim platform, uh, very spacious, and on the port side we do have our boarding ladder that falls down into the water and stores away very conveniently. We also do have our port side cockpit entry door. Uh, if you have small ones, it'll keep them safely in the boat. And then right next to that we do have our large live well. It's equipped with a clear lid so you can see what's down in there. We also do have our rear bench seat that stows away conveniently. If you want to fish, you no know, family on board that day, you can fold it out of the way, freeze up some cockpit space. And then we do have our removable backrest that frees up two rod holders. Fresh water fill. Uh, this boat does have stainless steel hardware pull up cleats. Mid cockpit, we do have our leaning post, fiberglass leaning post. You'll notice this boat does have the white powder coating option. Very nice, very elegant feature. Uh, really makes the boat. On the rear of the leaning post, we do have four rod holders. And we do have some tackle tray organizers. And two additional drawers on the very back. In front of the leaning post, we do have a storage compartment uh, to keep your valuables safe and dry. And then this one does have a fold down, full rest, also powder coated. The helm, stainless steel steering wheel with a tilt helm, Yamaha digital gauges, nice big compass, uh, your 12 volt accessory switches, uh, trim tap controls, our remote for our Sony stereo and then your Yamaha digital throttle and shift controls. Down below, additional storage. And then up top, we do have our deluxe hardtop, powder coated, which is equipped with the electronics box and additional storage. On this hardtop, we do have two Sony speakers and then five rod holders off the back. Again, the white powder coating on this looks great. And then this one does feature the dark blue, I believe it's a sapphire blue gel coat on the bottom side of the hardtop to match the bottom color of the hull. Um, as you'll see in the pictures, it is a very elegant package. Port side of the console, we do have a porthole, and that is for the enclosed head with a porta potty down there. And we do have our Sony stereo safely stored away from the elements. We do also have our waste pump out, dockside waste pump out. And then before we move forward, we have some very large in-floor fish boxes that are gas shock assisted. Then right next to that in the gun walls, we do have some rod storage racks in the gun walls. Moving forward, very nice, very solid, low profile grab rail that wraps around the bow section of the boat. It will not interfere if you're casting off from the bow. And also a very nice feature, speaking of casting off, is this removable center insert up here at the bow. Frees up some deck space. Again, if you are casting off, very nice feature. The very bow, we do have our large anchor locker. Anchor pop-up pleat. This particular 237 is equipped with bow cushions. They are removable. And underneath the bow cushions, we do have our fish boxes or storage boxes. Plenty of space down there. Center of the bow cockpit, we do have a large end floor fish box. Then forward of the console, we do have a forward console seat with a backrest, of course your windshield. There is some storage underneath that cushion. Well, so you can see this 237 is a well-equipped 
Very nice center console, again built by Cobia. Let's go ahead and take it out on the water, show you how she runs with this Yamaha 254 stroke. Well, the Yamaha 250 pushes this Cobia 237 very well out on the water. Uh, it is a bit of a windy day here. We do have a little bit of chop, but got it over 40 miles per hour, and I think mid 40s would be very easy with the combination. Uh, this boat is a very elegant package. Two-tone beige upholstery, white hull sides, but then on the bottom of the hull, you do have that sapphire blue. Looks stunning, but still looks classic. You have this white powder coating, and you have a sapphire blue bottom of the hard top here. It's just a very elegant package, perfect Palm Beach boat. And the stainless steel hardware throughout the boat only adds to that elegance. Very, very well equipped. Um, very nice riding 237 center console. Again, Yamaha F250, four stroke on the back. Should you want one built to your specifications, we are a Cobia dealer here in Palm Beach. We can build one to your specifications to get that to you. If you have any questions on this particular boat, please contact our sales department and to view our full inventory, visit marineconnection.com. From Marine Connection in West Palm Beach, my name's Yanni. God bless and have a great day.